Welcome to Guns and Gear Network everyone. Appreciate you tuning in. Today we're going to add sling attachments to a Mossberg 88 shotgun. Stay tuned. Welcome back guys, appreciate you tuning in. So today we are going to add sling attachments to the Mossberg 88 or Maverick 88 uh, by Mossberg. Also, uh, this would apply to most all Mossberg 500 shotguns and we'll get into fit uh, here in just a second. Uh, be sure uh, to check out the Amazon store. You'll find this item along with others that we review and recommend in the channel. Uh, I have since changed up how I link things so I've created a link tree so you want to click the link tree first to go over to any uh, links that I share with you guys just uh, trying to work around uh, some of the new policies with YouTube so be sure just to check out the link tree it'll take you over to this and a few other links that are sponsors of the channel all right, so with that said, you may have bought a Maverick 88 or a Mossberg 500, and it does not have sling attachments. This is the Maverick 88 Security. It does not have sling attachments. So a simple $10 solution is by Uncle Mike's, and this right here is their Quick Detachable Super Swivels. And again, I have these in my store. So it comes in a few parts and pieces here. We're going to check this out. So when I say these fit most, I'll show you what you need to look for to make sure it'll fit your application. So first things first, does your shotgun have this little hole right here in the buttstock? If it does, then you're probably fine. Uh, for at least this end, we'll show the other end here in a minute. All right, so I'm missing one piece out of this. And this right here is really not necessary. If you don't want to add it, I will add it just because, which is this little white o-ring here simple easy i just get something like this i mean as long as it'll fit inside of here like an allen wrench or something and you simply if you want to put some blue loctite on this you could i don't really see necessary but that's up to you it comes with um some loctite you're going to get it to a point of where it's going to you want the hole I'll show you here in a second the correct orientation. So you want it where you can see the hole on the side like that. And it may crack your white uh, piece. It did mine just a little bit. So that's where you want it on this end. All right, so on this end, what you're looking for, and by the way, all these, this firearm has been safety checked and cleared prior to filming. Uh, you want to look and see if your end cap here has this little hole. If it does, then this right here is what you're going to add to it. And I think... This, if I'm not mistaken, is their form of Loctite or at least some type of glue. Let me make. Yeah, they call theirs a uh, drop of gun tight. Uh, I don't know what that means, but okay. I'll assume it's a form of, I'm going to poke a little hole into this at one end. And we're just going to put a drop. You don't need much. It's almost like glue, to be honest with you. That's what it looks like, more so than Loctite. But we'll put a little bit on that end. And we're simply going to thread this in like that. Um, I will say this. It does not time just right because I had to re-time it with this. And I can do that. So I'm going to tighten it down pretty snug. And then I'll back this off. I may need pliers to do it. I don't know if I can get that loosened enough. So it's kind of sacrificing this being not as tight to time it with this. But you get the idea. And then it comes with your uh, sling attachments. These are one inch. I'm not a fan of one inch, but I'm gonna go ahead and use them anyway. I was more concerned about the attachment points themselves um, than pretty much these. So you just turn this like that and 
stick it in and like that and then there you go like I said I am going to loosen this to hopefully time that correctly it'll be fine same thing on this end you unscrew that first push that over pull that down and then we are going to slide that in push rotate that around and then if you want to tighten that lock it back in you can and you can simply use these for kind of a cutie if you got hook type sling attachments or whatever and there you go but anyway guys pretty simple solution 10 bucks allows you to now have a sling i recommend a sling uh, or sling attachments on anything that you would potentially uh, carry for self-defense hunting things like that just makes better sense anyway guys appreciate you tuning in if you got questions post those below and as always like share and subscribe bring the video shortly have a great day